Now, officers and recruitment centers are not allowed to carry guns, leading many to wonder if yesterday's shooting will change current security measures. News Channel 7's Leanna Scacchetti has been checking in with our local recruiting offices this afternoon. She joins us live in the studio. And Leanna, what did you learn today? Ron and Nisa, military officials say there aren't any major changes to security in our area, but recruitment offices are remaining vigilant. This morning, two Panama City police officers were near local recruitment offices. Lieutenant Mark Laramore with the police department says officers aren't standing guard there, but they are checking in with the offices more often. Laramore said all law enforcement received notice from Homeland Security to have extra patrols near recruiting centers. Someone in the Army office told me police told them to carry on as usual, but to be vigilant and report anything suspicious and the marine officer recruiter said he was told to keep the office's doors locked and open just for appointments and officials we spoke with at Tyndall Air Force Base said there was no imminent threat to the base and no ma major changes would be made there an official with the lo local army recruitment center told me they're still not permitting any weapons in recruiting centers they're discussing current security measures and will follow orders from command as they receive them Ron Okay, Leanna, thank you. Officials with the Marine Corps say reserve centers across the country will stay open and continue to be active.